Yes. How do you feel? How do you feel when you watch a military movie? <laughs> uh, wow. Uh, I used to be, um, I think some of those really inspired me to be what I am today. Okay. Um, when I was in secondary school, uh, straight from primary, I think, primary seven, eight, you know, the Rambo movies yes, back yes, in the yes. day. Yes. Uh, the Shaolin, I, I knew all the Shaolins, I guess, by the time I was in secondary school. Yes. Um, but, I mean, these days uh, we critique. If you get a bunch of us watching <laughs> stuff, we critique. We go like, ah, get Chukwa left, oh, he's go, either gone left or right. Yes, yeah, yes, we, yes. We, we get really worked up. Yes. Mm. Because you'd critique, you'd see a lot of uh, flaws, mistakes, tactical errors, really refined, um, you know, kind of stuff that we do that you'd watch. Like the Alfred, Alfred Mutuas, with all due respect, yes. the Alfred Mutuas, was it a Rambo movie or Cobra something? Squad, yes. Cobra Squad, absolutely. I mean, uh, all of them could be ranging around that. And unless there are documentaries that have been done by people who have inside information about the mechanics, yes, how yes. things work. Yeah. But, you know, they, they're pretty boring, in most part, uh, especially the Rambo ones that we watch. So back basically, when we get impressed by what Jason Statham does in his movies, yes. you are like, nah. <laughs> yeah, absolutely, to some extent, yes. <coughs> so, Iso Vitu, Chiniyamaji, in your own space, you can do them. Man, <laughs> yes, to be sincere. Um, you guys are now being treated to quite a few uh, exposures of the special forces in ops. Yes, We've seen yes. people go down to business, and you know, in town. It's, uh, not thanks, but I'd, I'd have said thanks to terrorism. Um, but I mean, you've now had to see people demonstrate that uh, capacity and capability, which is really deadly to, to see. And yes, we've been in the theater, same same theater. So you see some of the things that you'd watch with a lot of awe in the past. Yeah. And you're in the theater and you're doing them, and you'd be in a minute thrashed into the jungle doing jungle warfare business, and it's really, really crazy. And you go to be very sure footed, you don't crack a twig like you see in the movies. Yes, I did that for six months in Mount Helgon. Of course, holidaying at the Amber Villas is a great experience, but owning it. Calling this your home with from as low as 4.5 million Kenya shillings. I don't even need to mention it. For more information about this property, please visit www.ambervillasmalindi.com or use the contact details on your screen or click the link in the description below.